the handcuffs. Handcuffs have been used as a means of restraint for several centuries. However, before 1862, they were essentially a one-size-fits-all device. These early cuffs, which were simply metal rings that locked in place, created discomfort for people with thick wrists and were ineffective when used on people with thin wrists. That changed in 1862, when William Adams revolutionized the device with the invention of adjustable ratchets that could bind wrists tightly or loosely. There are different types of handcuffs but we're gonna focus on the most common type used by the police in the United States and other countries. The cuffs have nine parts. The double strand. The single strand. Swivel with links. The key. The rivets. Locking lever. Metal spring. Double lock slide. Double lock pin. Let's see how the handcuffs work. Most of the time that the cuffs are pushed onto the hand of the criminal which allow the single strand to rotate behind the hand and lock back again. When the single strand is moving, is pushing the locking lever, red part. Both red part and single strand have teeth that interconnect and allow the bracelet to tighten but not loosen. The teeth are held together by a metal spring, yellow part, and it serves two things, as the detach for the double lock slide. Nothing stops the cuffs to tighten even more and to hurt the hand of the criminal, so to stop that, we need to engage that blue slide. The cop pushes a pin on the side with the back of the key, and once it is engaged the cuffs cannot tighten. To unlock the handcuffs the key is required to be turned in both directions, first counterclockwise to disengage the double lock and then clockwise to disengage the locking lever. Some facts about the handcuffs. The word handcuff was first seen in English in 1591 for a decorative band at the end of sleeves. The earliest use as a means of restraint was in an English parliamentary paper of 1649 referring to a man being manacled with handcuffs of iron. The European Patent Office now lists around 650 handcuff-related patents. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to see more awesome videos.